everybody and welcome back to some more Pokemon Black. Uh, let's play. It's, yeah. it's a game <laughs> and we're playing it. <laughs> now, uh, in the last one, we went and revisited Wellspring Cave, which I mispronounced as Mr. Alton Cave, a completely different cave. Um, <laughs> one that we're never going to go back to. Oh, hi. So you do not put on any repairs. Sure. Put it on in the fucking thingy. What's the difference between doing it now and then? No, you're so right. I didn't think I'd run into a level 20 Pokemon. Man, these Pokemon are pretty tough out here. <laughs> Charon's getting wiped to level 20 Darumakas. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit! What voice did I use for her again? You gave her a high-pitched voice, just like her father. Hi there, Phoenix! I heard about these Pokemon statues, and I came to look into their origins! I've learned that each of these Pokemon statues is actually a real Pokemon! Holy shit! It's called Dermanitan! No, it's not, stupid. It's sleeping, so it's become like a stone! When I quickly measured how long they've existed, it was amazing! Around 2,500 years! Seems like they went to sleep that long ago. That means they've been here since <laughs> before the, this place was in ruins, when the Relic Castle was flourishing. I would love a Unova game where we got to see the Relic Castle, like in its heyday, before it got piled by sand. <laughs> Perhaps they were guarding the city. These Pokemon, they are either in a state of hibernation or meditation. So if you wake them, they will become active once again. No shit, that's what happens when you wake something up. And the item that wakes up to Manitan is actually... This Rage Candy Bar! That's why I'll share one with you too, Phoenix. Yay! Now we can wake them up! Well, I'm headed back to the Pokemon Resource Lab. Be seeing you! Bye! I kinda wanna... Let's wake one up. Let's wake up this one. I feel like he's got a good attitude. Give the rage candy bars to the Pokemon statue? Yeah, <laughs> you're like, hey bro, try this some of this chocolate. <laughs> Thanks to Pokemon statue responded to the rage candy bar. The Pokemon was a sleepy Dermantan. They wakened Dermantan attack. Well, that's really cool. It went from blue to red. <laughs> Level so, 35? So does this one have its hidden abilities? Yes. The ones out here have their hidden abilities on mode. So obviously we're gonna catch one. With one of my 51 Pokeballs. I definitely don't want to hit this thing. Because it's level 35 and we're in our 50s. Last thing I want to do is fucking like shank uh, an ancient bee. That was really easy to catch. Yeah. The blazing Pokemon. It's, inter five. it's internal fire burns at 2,500 degrees Fahrenheit, making enough power that it can destroy a dump truck with one punch. I'll show you a dump truck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, we're not gonna need it. You're gonna just in the box forever. He got awakened from his 2,500 year slumber, and I just shoved it in a Pokeball and threw it in my PC forever. <laughs> That's just how the pizza bites. Alright, let's see. Back Chappelle. Oh, we gotta get this shit done. Oops. Back Chappelle. That's it. I, lo I love looking up from my computer and seeing my two Sanji figures just, just standing there. You act like, you act like, oh, like, it's so cool that they're up there. Like, you weren't the one that should put them up there. And, well, I can still admire the work. Like, you, like, when you put, like, your computer up and everything, like, build it, don't you look back at it and you're like, wow, I did that. It's different. It's my baby. It, this is my baby. <laughs> well, it's the bubble you go. Yeah. I'm trying to remember the exact way. This one. Do you know the way? <laughs> Do you know the way? Yeah, it's this one. Yeah, and then the fucking, like, two people were here and it, it wasn't even a double battle. Yeah, two single battles. Yeah. Look! It's open now! Oh my goodness, it wasn't there before. Yeah, single sealed. 
Oh! Uh, <laughs> Question... Wait, no. Question mark! Exclamation point, exclamation point. Damn, that dude ran fast. I just imagine him going... Ah! <laughs> just fucking booking it. I can see it! Oh, there it is! <laughs> ah! Okay! Sir, so you went the wrong direction! <laughs> Out with you. Yeah. No W and R. W W. Crocodile. Sixty four. Oh my god, when did they get good? Well, good thing we love with Kai. Kai, this is gonna be a hell of experience for you. Grass knot or oh, you said mystical water. So good old fashioned surf. Oh, this thing, this thing kills you. It has moxie. It does it. Oh yeah, because it didn't use Intimidate. Oh. <laughs> Fuck you! Yeah. Yeah, bitch. I'm good- I'm good at Pokémon. Look at these stats. I'm uh, falling in the Relic Castle! <laughs> it's like he tripped. <laughs> I've fallen and I can't get up! Ryoku of the Seven Sages is looking for a Pokémon inside the Relic Castle. I was his lookout so he wouldn't be interrupted. Stupid, stupid, stupid me. Plus we- Oh, did I mention stupid? I don't remember the one that made Nick. It all adds up to Nick and Poop. You got anything else to say? He's just saying the exact same things. Yeah, he's that stupid. I, I, there's a couple of items in here. Dang. I don't know how many different- Paths there are in this place, but we'll find it. Just keep going in a circle. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit! We found it. Found that was it. fast. I was planning to catch the Pokemon called Volcarona that lives in its relic castle and present it to Getsus. But the Shadow Triad said that Getsus has gone somewhere, right? Yeah, he's going on vacation. <laughs> Yeah, he's gone on, uh, he's gone with the international police. Yeah. <laughs> I think he's still at large. Well, I, th I thought they took him away. No, 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 like, Charon and Alder were bringing him to custody, like, what they were doing before we went on a date with him, and then, like, apparently the Shadow Train showed up and, like, swooped him away. So he's still at large. Uh, I guess that's why he's back in the second game. Yeah. Huh, really. Makes sense. Yeah. The Seven Sages. We always said we were complete when the seven of us were together. Now I don't know the meaning of those words anymore. I always thought it was weird that Gessus was the only one that looked different than us. <laughs> Why did he get to be the leader of the Seven Sages? I thought we were all equals. <laughs> I guess I don't mind, even if we were being used, but that dream is over. I no longer need this. Gessus gave it to me, but I have no use for it. Come mind. Yes, I don't have one of those. Yeah, I can tell. This relic castle and our own castle are both crumbling. But what's different is that this relic castle is the remains of civilization, and our castle left nothing behind. Yo! Yo, it's Lurker! Regarding T-Plasma, I'm an officer of the International Police, and you must satisfy my requests of certain information. Understood. But we don't know much about Getsis or our Lord Ed. We haven't even figured out if they are father and son. Wait, you don't know that? <laughs> Except my thanks. Now, against us notwithstanding, there is remains but three of the seven sages still at large. What are they thinking upon what topics? What are they hoping upon what chances? This is the utmost urgency at once on the way! I'm gonna calmly walk over now. <laughs> Alright, well, this is, indicates it's a very important room because there's vases outside of it. So let's go in the very important room. Oh, she's so beautiful. Now, if you did get the egg from Route 18 and you hatch it, that turns into Larvesta. But Larvesta doesn't evolve until like level, what, 60? Yeah. It's very late. So I think it's 59. 
So if you were going to tackle the post game and your Pokemon are very level because all of them shoot up to level 64, I recommend catching this thing and adding it to your party to get your Pokemon leveled up. But we're not going to do that. We're going to put it in the box as soon as we catch it. All right. How dare you disrespect And let me just go ahead and, uh, yep, save just in case. <laughs> so we kill it. Oh, uh, it doesn't have special music. This thing's been sitting here since, like, the beginning of time, and... Is it level 70? <laughs> Alright, let's see what we can do. Do we have a quick ball? He's about to hit you with the rah <laughs> Yeah, the rah <rabber. laughs> Uh, what should we hit it with? That isn't Waterfall or Surf. Or you think it will survive with Waterfall? I don't know how bulky this thing is. That I do not Yeah, remember. I mean, you say you can always try it. Yeah, yeah waterfall, let's see. <laughs> but it's faster than us. Well, yeah, I wouldn't have that. Use bug bug. Oh, we're dead. Yeah. We never got to find out if waterfall would have killed it. Okay, so it's a fire bug. Yep, so we can use a rock. <laughs> yeah, four times we can get bugged. We can use Cosmo on it. Right? Just die yeah, let me take off this crown. It's actually making it hard for me to have my headphones on. <laughs> Oopsies. Uh, psychic? Or ac acrobatics won't do that much. Yeah, it's acrobatics. Because it. Like, get the fucking item on him again! Die. Is he? Oh, what did it boost? Everything. What? Was that like Asian power? Yeah. Alright, we throw Shadow Ball at it, right? That's the plan. You're a fucking Silver Wind! Water is this game. Oh, that's good. Bug Buzz. Phantom doesn't like that! Of course, our fucking special defense falls, of course. <laughs> you know who else is special defense dropped? Man, man! <laughs> You're so stupid. Quiver dance! Hey, only my little little gets to know that move. Thank you very much. Shadow ball again. He sounds like. Well, well, well. Ah! It wasn't even a critical hit, it just did that much. Aha, fuck you, fuck you. Uh, I'm gonna just. Should I protect? Sure. Use this quiver dance, this might be bad. Wow. I think I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> that was like one in four chance. It just chooses moves at random. Yeah. Alright, let's start throwing shit at it. Good old fashioned Ultra Ball. I love Ultra Balls. I don't want to hear them though. Like I said, I love. <laughs> giraffes are awesome. I love giraffes. <laughs> oh, I wish there was a giraffe in this game. Gyro. Yeah. But I don't think it's actually in this game. I think you have to import it. Giraffe Yeah. Is it, not, is it in this game? I don't think so. Yeah, it, I mean it powers up if you try to catch a bug. <laughs> YOLO. Ah. Oh! Nice! <gasps> I bought all those Ultra Balls for nothing. <laughs> There's other legendary Pokemon and shit for us to catch, so we'll be fine. I don't even think Volcrona is a legend. I guess it's a legendary or pseudo legendary. No, it's just a Pokemon. But like, it's still pretty. I mean, we have the the the, the last of the sword Pokemon. Then we have Kiram, and then we have the genie flying around right now. So it's called a Sun Pokemon. Doesn't Alder have one? Does he? I thought this was like his signature Pokemon. I thought his signature Pokemon was Buff Buffalant. Oh yeah, it probably is. 
When volcanic ash darkened the atmosphere, it is said that Volcarona's fire provided a replacement for the sun. I wonder if that's why it's called the sun Pokemon. <laughs> that's pretty cool if it is. Uh, no, we're not gonna name it. It'd be disrespectful. It's been sitting here and I'm not gonna name it something stupid. Look at the pretty- like it, they made it like its own little house down here. Oh, the repel were off, but I think there's a Pokemon down here that we can can grab in this room. Yeah, he does have one. Huh. Quite on. And, and it's his signature Pokemon. Oh, okay. It's his Um. Yeah. Alright, we got this guy. Good old crunch. Oh, he's cool. I'm pretty sure he's fine. I'm Gen 3. Yep, yeah. oh, I killed him. Uh, <laughs> I was gonna catch him. Maybe we'll find one on the way out. Maybe we'll find his pre evolved form. A little ball toy. No, I think the Claydon's the only one in here. Oh well. We call him. Slash. Forty seven. You guys need to get your shit together. I want to catch it. See, I have to catch it. Oh, yeah, I did that much. Oh, good job, Slash. He's like Slash. <laughs> Yay! I got the sand slash. He's a little hedgehog. Yep. It curls up and then rolls its foe with it back. It sharp spines and inflicts severe damage. So that's a mouse Pokemon. I thought it was a hedgehog. Mm. Pizza. Rolling around at the speed of sound. Nope. We gotta find the exit. I should probably put the repel back in. Oh. Yeah. That's so cool that we caught it now. This thing's brown, right? No, it's uh, brown. I was like, oh, brick break. Nah. Are you Sand Slash. Oh my god, how did you know? Sand Slash. Get the fuck out of here! I'm glad they fixed it in the second game where if you ran out of repel, it asks you if you want to put it on again. <laughs> yeah. No, that's not where the repels are. <laughs> Alright. There's still- there's three of the seven sages left. Can you believe it? Oh, there we go. Here's the exit. Yes. There's another tower. I couldn't remember. See, now it's all sand. And then more sand. I love sand. And then there's more sand. And then there's earthquake. Oh, yeah. It's such a tease, because, like, like you can't go over here, so you just see the earthquake on the other side. Yeah, you can literally just see it, and it's just like... Yeah, but you can't do shit about it. It's like, oh yeah, sorry, you can't get this. Oopsie daisies. Whoops, my bad. Alright. Let's get the fucking you. item real quick. <laughs> I'm making you dead Pokemon fire. Yeah, yeah. I say. I forgot. <laughs> I think we should go for one more stage. Yeah. Let me heal real quick. I don't- well, there's a little cool thing I want to show off in the boss, so see if anything changed. <laughs> you know what? I think it'd be really cool if we, uh, we played Pokemon Ranger on the emulator. Pokemon Ranger? Yeah. So like I'm guessing you have to fucking like yeah, you have to make the circle. So I'm guessing you have to use your mouse. <laughs> Just oh make circles gosh. on the screen. <laughs> I remember playing this shit as a kid. Yeah, 
It was a lot of fun. I was like beating up my DS trying to try to yeah, like, that shit. In indenting it forever. I thought there was something over here, but it was just a guy. But there's some cool things, so if you do want to level up fast for the post game, uh, you can now uh, go to the small and the big stadium because they upgraded their Pokemon a lot. So we can get Molly Lock super fast now. <laughs> nice. Yep, and I'll demonstrate that now. Also, you can get items from them. I know definitely in the second game you do, hopefully in the first one. See? Now there's, instead of three being here, there's more people. The ideal movement of living things, such a pure beauty. Ah! Let me behold them! No. <laughs> you don't get to behold anything. Behold my cock. <laughs> Pierre. <laughs> Smeargle! What? <laughs> Level 65? <laughs> Alright. Waterfall. He made it all this way by having a level 65 Smeargle on that well, he, he had fucking Blizzard on that thing. And he died. Yay! I saw the beauty up close! You know, beauty here. Just ugly. What are there such great... Ch if there are great children who will become stars someday that they are now just kids at my preschool. Whatever. <laughs> When we're battle, we'll probably go next to the next city. I just wanted to show this off. I'll probably do these off screen to level up the Pokemon a bit more. Yeah, you yeah. I mean, yeah. it's like 60 plus. Yeah. Especially in the post game. So this is good training for what to expect. But like I said, you could you could just throw the, the Laura Besta in your party. Not the Laura the Pokerona in your party and just go through that. I can send enough shit. Waterfall! Oh, How annoying. <laughs> Meteor Smash! Yeah. Oh, well, so the moon's still. Okay. So, how do you play it based on? Yeah, I guess you're right. Really out of the ordinary. Oh, he's gonna fuck a metronome or whatever, and it's like, oh, I learned to move! Draco Meteor! <laughs> he's on a fucking cute charm. Oh, I, I, I know. Bubble. Okay, that's good. You can really get fucked over by using those moves. No, 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 the metronome where it just puts a random move, like, oh. like just in the universe that it, like, in the Pokemon game, yeah, you can get real fucked over by that. Just uses explosion. <laughs> I've seen that in Nuzlocke, in Nuzlocke. What? Pokemon uses metronome and just happens to hit explosion and kill off one of the runners' Pokemon. Nice. You are quite brilliant, but real stars are cool. Shut up! I just saved the universe! I told her to shove a cube of orange candy. I, I love this girl. Should I get autographs now for my children who are most likely to be stars? <laughs> That's so savage to go have all the children that are successful and you're like, Can I get your autograph and leave the other children behind? <laughs> Alright. So that's in the Basa City. Maybe we can do the battle subway at some point. I feel like that'd be cool. Subway. Yeah. I don't think I ever participated in the Battle Subway. I... Oh! Oh, Charon's here! I'm gonna go heal real quick. Where's, where's Charon? I didn't know he was here. If I did, I would have actually went over and battled him. Walking nerd emoji. <laughs> yeah, walking nerd emoji, nerd emoji. <laughs> Me when I play fucking Stardew Valley. Just a fucking nerd. <laughs> Trying to think now. I think Driftvale City only has the cold storage for us to do, and that's it. But it is cool to revisit. Yay, our Pokemon are healed highly. Alright, let's go beat the shit out of Charon. 
don't remember anything about the full search. Wasn't one of those seven sages just like chilling in a freezer? Yeah, he's like, I thought this was a good place to hide. Uh, it turns out it wasn't. <laughs> Go Pokemon. Yeah. Does he attack you? I think so. I think he has a cryogonal. Really? I, I don't remember. I don't figure remember it out. Either. Hi, Charon. Are you having an episode? Oh, the sad music's playing. Strength and strength alone is, is what matters in this world. So I believe, until I met Alder here. But winning in Pokemon battles isn't all there is to life. Once I learned that lesson, my eyes were open to many different things. We all have our own brand of strength. People on Pokemon both. The strength to make our dreams a reality. The strength to protect what we hold dear most. Why do I think this way now? It's thanks to you, Phoenix. And Bianca. And Alder. If only Ang could see this too, someday. Oh, but alas, Ang is fucking dead. No, he's he's traveling. He's on vacation with the Gensets. <laughs> I'm going to take a long, hard look at myself on Victory Road. I'm going to think about what I can do and who I can become. Visit me sometime if you want. We'll have a battle in old times. And he was doomed to wander Victory Road for eternity. Yeah. Well, I know where he is on Victory Road. So. It's like the seven, seven rings of hell. Like, his is just walking around Victory Road. Yeah, that's his ring of hell. I love how, like, it's so cool that they base this region off of the USA. Like, this is like the, the, the Golden Bridge. In Castilia cities like New York. Yeah. What are the, any of the other places or references? Like the towns? Or the yeah, like the yeah. Oh, it's hailing! I was like, what the fuck is that noise? I don't know. I don't know. There's probably like a guy book out there somewhere who's like. Uh, this town in uh, this area is like a is a reference to this small town in like Pennsylvania. <laughs> some, some stupid shit like that. You can already see it. All right, it's very cold in here. My girl is not prepared. She's wearing shorts. <laughs> is there more workers than there was. No, the same amount of workers. I mean, they were here for the Pokemon battles. Alright. <laughs> hey, it's the guy that like, was bitching. He's like, oh, I'm cold in here! So, you returned. You're an odd trainer. Alright, I got time enough to satisfy your curiosity. Breathing. B breathing. I don't know how to do that. <laughs> having a heart that beats. That is simple existence and nothing more for a living being. That may be difficult, a definition of living, but I don't think that defines life. I'm gonna keep walking. The experience of joy and suffering is a vital part of being alive. Gensis gave me the sensation of being truly alive. What do you mean to accomplish? That isn't what's important. I'm gonna keep walking to keep myself warm. <laughs> It is quite cold in here, after Yeah. All. Right now, I'm shivering. <laughs> I'm suffering, but I'm alive. He keeps walking! <laughs> Pokemon and people live... Live by... Yeah. Live by being together and relying on one another. That might be how you feel. If that's so, it's necessary to, to separate people and Pokemon? By talking to you, I discovered that there's much more I need to think about. I wish... I had more to give you and thanks. Here, take this. Home claws, even though we got fucking swords dance. <laughs> Keep walking. <laughs> Gotta get my steps in. <laughs> hey, I'm walking here. Yeah. <laughs> my lord N said that he wanted to make Pokemon perfect. But even if the relationship between Pokemon and people stays the way it is, Pokemon can inspire to perfection. <laughs> it's cold in here! Indeed, I am the officer of the International Police, and I demand to hear all you know about Team Plasma. It's too cold, and I'm already tired of shivering in here. And if you'll give me some time to think, I'll let you- I'll tell you what I know, so take me with you. Thanks many times over! 
Now, against this notwithstanding, there is remaining but two of the seven sages still at large. The thoughts that are com 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 whatever contemplating. contemplating in the hopes that they are anticipating these. These are what I want to know until our next meeting. Where do you think he's keeping all the seven sages? In a box. <laughs> he's got a cardboard box. Wait, that wait, just has them in a... wait. Hold on. We'll go outside in a second, and then I'll explain. <laughs> Hold on. Let's see, let's see, hold on. Oh, it's still handling out here. Here, you know these, like, cargo boxes that are out here? That he's probably one of those. Like, see, he probably put them on one of those ships. And just, like, keeping them in a box and shipping them to the International Police Station. Here's a, here's a mint condition Zinzolid. <laughs> Mint condition! Very rare! <laughs> Very rare, one of a kind. Yeah. Should I buy any of these incense? Rock move, water, grass, water again. Is there any Psychic. That you don't have like a... Uh, you probably don't have one for fire or grass, do you? No. Well, there's no fire one. There's psychic. There's gray. Yeah. Just one, please. Thank you. There's a lax one. What's the lax one do? Next me missed the holder. Loaded and moves slower. What's the one? Prize money is doubled. Oh, so it's like an amulet. Yeah, yeah. We'll keep you in mind, sir. Thank you for your service. <laughs> you did your country proud. Yep. Is there anything in here? It's just a school. Alright, everyone, listen up on the fucking ground now! <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not that kind of school. <laughs> this is American. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, man. Is there. At least our schools aren't shooting ranges! Shut <laughs> up! <laughs> At least I don't get shot in mathematics. <laughs> Mathematic. Alright. Okay, we don't do anything in that city. Tusto Tower's good. Trust Mountain doesn't have anything. Dragonsparrow Tower doesn't have anything for us. Surprisingly, I thought one of the seven stations would be there. Uh, there's the Iris. Uh, this one doesn't have anything. Rat 8 doesn't have anything. That one doesn't. So I guess our next destination is Route 9, because right there is Challenger's Cave. I'm challenged. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so it sounds like my cave. Yep. It's the one that everyone thought Mewtwo was in. Was he? No! <laughs> We're fucking lied to so hard. Oh, I don't think I, I don't think I ever got to see this this city. Really? It's the futuristic one. Yeah, well, th that's what I'm saying. I don't think I ever got to see this one. When did you join the adventure? Uh, fuck if I know. Yeah. I think it was. I think it was when you're on the route right above this. Really? Yeah, I guess so. Well. It's a cool area. Very yeah, cool. Yeah, I've never actually seen this this area. Before. Yeah, and then this is under construction. Yep, yeah, very futuristic. Yeah, because I had. Um, you have Pokemon White. Yeah, and I have Pokemon White too. So, yeah. so I've never seen the Black City either. No. Oh, it's such a treat. I. No, it's not. Honestly, White Forest is way better. Because Black City, like, the way it works is that once you enter the city, it starts like a digital timer, and you have to visit the fucking city every day, and if not, the people in it will just fucking disappear. <laughs> so it will just be empty, and nothing in it. Which is why if you go on, like, Google or YouTube, and you search Black City, one of the first results will be Black City Empty. Because people were like, I had all these people, and then, like, I came back, and they were just gone. What do I do? So people fucking don't like Black City that much. At least in White Forest, you get Pokemon. Oh, yeah, that's true. I remember that you get, you get 
encounters. Yeah, you get some pretty good encounters. Well, you have to like go every day and then talk to some people, and they're like, "Oh, there's a Pokemon called Blank in this forest. Go catch one." And yeah. they like bring all these new ones. Yeah, I, I remember waiting on uh, like a really long time to get something rare. It was like a pseudo legendary. Oh, I, think, I think it was like Bagon or something. Yeah. Oh, I think it was. Yeah, yeah Bagon's in there. Yeah. But, um, but anyway, I guess the, the next time we play this game, we're going to be in Challenger's Cave. I will level up my Pokemon with the like the small and big court, so I, I will get these motherfuckers up. Don't worry. Oh, uh, will you now? Yeah, somewhat. Even Cosmo. Maybe he'll become useful. Not, not use, use. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Hopefully. But anyway, my name is Phoenix, and that was Cameron, and we'll see you guys next time! Bye! Bye.